So what yeah. is it what is it about Berkeley that helps a musician compared to someone that doesn't go to Berkeley? Just in general, what have you noticed? I mean I think community. When you're in a place where there are many musicians at not just at leave alone at your disposal, but you also get to interact with them, there's a different way your brain works, you know? Versus you being on your own, making your own art ETC, like the access you have to people from all over the world. Like we used to do recordings with some friends of mine from um what's this place called? It's off the coast of France. Um what is it called? Earlier uh, oh Lyon. No, Lyon is in <laughs> Lyon is in France. Um um it's so it's like on the tip of my tongue. Mm. I don't know if you can find it. Um it's an island. Reunion. Yeah. Ah. Reunion Island. Mm. Um I met someone from there and or even people from like I have a friend from Madagascar, it was called Niraza, uh, Neoni, and she's incredible. Like meeting people like that, or even come, uh, people from all over America and South America. My friend Jonathan Padilla, he was an incredible, and even another lady on who's now on like I don't know if it's NBC or she. Her name is Nega. NBC. And yeah, she plays percussion. It's one of the house bands for a show oh. with John. His name is John Batiste. He was an incredible jazz musician. Like meeting people like that. And friends of mine now, one of them who's gone on tour with Harry Styles this last year. So it's incredible. Those are all the people you meet, and you don't know that that's the path they're going to take. But just the the way they work, you work together, and the way it makes your brain work is incredible. The way you start thinking about your arrangements or your songs, and just the exposure to that is incredible. One of my friends, Tim Reynolds, um, who shares a name with uh, the uh, Dave Matthews band member. <laughs> um, he, an incredible violinist and vocalist, you know, being part of projects like that, you know, it, it opens up your, even on your opportunities, but just the way you think about music and the way you think about relationships because a lot of the jobs you get is from references from these people. So it's not that you're, it's, it's just um, transactional. It's actually like, these are people who, we went, lived in the same houses. We ate food together. We we know we met each other's families. One of my best friends from college is from South Africa, and we are still friends to this day. Not even because of just the music making, but because we are actually friends. You know, mm-hmm. and if she can refer me for something, she does. You know, so wow, yeah. So 